In this video, I show you how to fix clownfish not working. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. I really do appreciate it. And please do watch this video right into the end to the full steps. And let's go and get straight into this. First thing you need to go and do is open up clownfish if you haven't already. So as you can see, I've got my clownfish launcher here. This is just a shortcut. I'm going to go and click on the main one. So when you go and double click on it, just like so, it's now going to launch up. Now you need, either need to go to the bottom right of your computer and go from the show hidden icon and you need to go next to it. As you can see, I've got this sort of clownfish voice changer. For some reason it's invisible, but if you just hover your mouse over a spare icon in this tray, you're probably going to go and find it. However, you can also just go and double click on the original launcher as well here. So double click on that and you go and get the same list or you can go and right click in here and you go and get that same list. So once you go and see this list here, all you need to do is go and click on setup and then system integration and then it's going to go and launch the setup menu here. I'm going to go and zoom in on this for you. And what you need to do is make sure you go and have the right mic you want to use um, for your computer installed for Clownfish. As you can see, I personally use the microphone USB PMP sound device, which is why it says install and all of the others here remove. However, if you want to go and use a different mic, but another one's already being installed, you then need to go and click remove and go and install the other mic you like. For example, I could go and remove this mic and go and switch to line USB by clicking install. But make sure you just have one select at a time. Once you've changed that setting, let's just go and open Clownfish up again. But now we need to go and open up the Clownfish dashboard. So you can either go and double click on, on the app icon here, or you can go to the bottom right once again. But I'm gonna go and double click on this, and then all you need to do is go and click on set voice changer, and it's gonna go and launch it. So as you can see, we've got a ton of different options. Now what you need to go and do is, is make sure that it's just set on clear, so nothing selected. But now I've just selected mixer so you guys can't hear an effect, but what we need to go and do is, is go and check if Clownfish is actually applying this voice change. In order to do that, either go to the bottom right and right click on Clownfish, or you can go and double click on your icon again. And what you need to go and do is, is go and click here microphone. And once you've clicked here microphone, what it's gonna go and do is, is you're gonna go and hear yourself back. So everything I'm saying right now, I can go and hear back my own ears. Then all you want to do is go and apply a pitch or an effect, for example, helium. And then now you should be able to go and hear that the helium has been applied. If you heard the pitch you just applied in Clownfish, this means Clownfish is doing its job properly. Now, another reason why Clownfish isn't working is because what you're trying to use your mic in, for example, Skype or Discord, you haven't got the right mic selected. So all you need to do is go and open up the app you're trying to use, for example, Discord. And then you want to go and click on the user settings and come to the left hand side. And all you need to do is go and click on voice and video. Then once you're in voice and video, come to voice settings and you need to make sure you're using the same input device as you selected in Clownfish. As you noticed earlier, I was using microphone USB PMP sound device. Therefore, it should be selected in my Discord and then Discord's gonna use the mic which has got the pitch applied to it. For example, I applied the helium effect to this. Well, I will do um, and now it's gonna be using that mic on Discord. If you're using say line and you haven't applied the effect to the line mic, then it's not gonna be used. That's really important and you may need to do this manually for each program you want to use Clownfish in. And if things still aren't working, then try and restart your computer and if that still doesn't work, go and fully uninstall Clownfish, restart your computer and then reinstall it and then things should be working but most of the methods I've shown in this video will fix before having to go to that length. If you found this video useful please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.